Hi, and welcome to HUDKing.com, your source for real virtual tours of HUD homes in and around the San Antonio and Houston area. I've been specializing in HUD homes since 1996, and in 2012, I started filming real virtual tours like the one you're about to watch. So connect with me by clicking on one of our social media links, or if you're watching this video on YouTube, click the subscribe button to be instantly notified of new uploaded videos. Now on to the home. We are here in the Glen Cairn subdivision. Glen Cairn is located on the west side of Houston, and we are standing in front of 16819 Keith Harrow. That's 16819 Keith Harrow. This is a charming little three-bedroom, two-bath, single-story home, approximately 1,908 square feet. It was built in 1976. This home is about $19,000 underneath the county appraisal. It is very popular. As you can see, there are a couple of cars in the driveway. Uh, the price on this home is, is really affordable, and the fact that it's open to the $100 down payment incentive and there's repair money available, I think is another reason why this home might be really desirable, because it's actually a really good layout. It's, like I said, over 1,900 square feet. Exterior of this home is a combination of brick, and it looks like they upgraded some of the siding with hardy plank. There is a little bit of wood siding around some of the pillars, but exterior-wise in pretty good shape. It, there is a little bit of wood rot that needs to be addressed, but uh, pretty minor stuff. The roof actually looks in de decent condition, and exterior-wise I think it just needs a little bit of power washing and some touch-up paint. You actually have access into getting into your garage right from the uh, entryway here, but there's also an access door inside that'll get you into your garage. Pretty standard two-car garage. Come around the corner here, and you have access into your backyard. So let's take a look at the backyard, and then we'll look at the inside. Well, there are actually two ways to get into the backyard. We can step into the backyard off of your formal dining room, and you step out into this little cupboard area. And then there's also a set of sliding glass doors off of your main family room. Now, what's kind of neat about this little layout here is you have a little covered area, but you also have these nice windows in your kitchen. So you could actually open up your kitchen. If you redid this countertop, have a really nice entertaining space on the outside, which I think would be really neat. It's a pretty modest sized backyard, not a whole lot of room. I do like that most of the exterior is brick. You do have some, it looks like they updated the upper part of the siding with hardy plank, which is a cement board fiber. They have this uh, city electrical panel box over here, which they've kind of enclosed, which I think is nice. Kind of makes it look a little bit cleaner back here. So exterior-wise, a fresh coat of paint around some of the siding. Maybe clean up some of these trees. You have a pecan tree, a couple of pecan trees back here, some fig trees, which is nice. I'll maybe work on a little bit of the fence. And that's about it. Let's take a look at the inside. Well, as we step into the home, we are immediately into a formal dining area. We have a lower kind of living, formal living area here with a fireplace, a dining room here. Bedrooms will be down this hallway, but if we continue in, we come into your kitchen and your family room. Now, the kitchen will need some cabinetry work. It will need some ceiling work, but I like how you have these big sliding glass doors in this big living room space. You also want to repair that wall there. It looks like they had some wall damage. Down this part of the hallway here, we have your laundry room and a little bit of storage. To the left here, we have your master bedroom. Master bedroom is a good-sized bedroom. Master bath is a little small, but it's functional. You have a single vanity. And you have a shower only. It does not have a tub in here. Then around the corner here we have your walk-in closet. Now down this hallway is where we'll have the additional bedrooms. To the left here we have bedroom number two, which will need a fresh coat of paint and probably some flooring. Directly across from that we have your master, I'm sorry, your second full bathroom, which is a single vanity and a shower and tub combo. Directly across from that we have Bedroom number three, which will need a fresh coat of paint and possibly some flooring. And then at the end of the hall here is where we have your two-car garage. And we have that access back into your formal living room or your dining room and your formal living room, sunken formal living room. So that's about it. The whole home is going to need a fresh coat of paint. I would suggest probably replacing the flooring. It's pretty neutral. Doesn't probably really need it, but I think it could really look nice if you did upgrade that. So let me give you a summary. Well, there you have it, 16819 Keith Harrow Boulevard. That's 16819 Keith Harrow Boulevard. A very nice three-bedroom, two-bath, single-story home. It's almost 2,000 square feet. It's about $19,000 underneath the county appraisal. has a ton of potential, and it's listed right now for only $129,000. So if you're interested in this home or you have any questions, please call me at 210 706 
0616. My name is Jonathan. I am the HUD King, and I want to help you find your castle.